So guys, today I'm up in Essex shooting some cars for the channel and this is the first one that I'm uh, given the keys to today. A Lotus 4 or 400, which is frankly insane to drive. That thing is utterly, utterly crazy. Colour is the one as well. Look at the sheer state of it. Yeah, that's perfect there. And this is the chap that owns it. James, thank you very much for letting me, uh, well, uh, all over your car. <laughs> it is just, it, uh, in person, it's just, it's mad. Obviously, the full review will give more of a sort of backstory as to what this car's all about and stuff, but as a car, just as a static look, looks unbelievable. And to drive, I've got to tell you, this is one of the best cars I've ever driven. The refinement, but the excitement is there, and that is what you want. Honestly, one of the best cars I have ever driven, that thing. It looks the utter nuts as well when it's cruising along. Oh! So bloody cool. Stay of it. <laughs> so yeah, we're gonna go get some exhaust shots and some uh, flybys of this beautiful Evora. I genuinely think I'm in love with this car. I think it's so cool. So as the Evora goes off into the distance, we're just gonna get a couple of uh, shots. I must say a massive thank you to James for letting me take his Evora out because my God, I, I know I've already said it in this video. I literally can't believe how good that car is. It's like so nice to drive. It's so nice to be in as well, which is so hard to find with a track based car like that. So obviously the full review is coming up. He's also got a Lotus Elise as well that we're gonna take out um, for the next shoot. And then obviously we've got the uh, 621 Jamie FYD sort of meet tonight as well that we're gonna do down at South End, which should be pretty sick. So yeah, the meet tonight down at South End. I'm gonna try and capture as much as I can uh, with the camera, but depending on weather and stuff, as you can see, it's a little bit cloudy today and a little bit windy. Sorry about the wind noise as usual. I still need to get sort of a wind sock for the top of this uh, this camera, but absolutely loving life today, especially with this uh, Evora. From the last Evora, obviously, that I went out in um, when I was at Auto Specialist, uh, when we were mapping and uh, doing a dyno day, the drive of one of those Avoras is next level. I can't believe how good it is. Ha 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 ha. My chariot awaits me. Awesome. Would you like me to demonstrate first? Yeah, if you could demonstrate on how to get into... Uh... I'll come around this side. <laughs> so, Lotus Elise with the roof on. That is cheating. So... <laughs> Lotus Elise, how do you get in this Lotus Elise? There is no... Look at the size of the, like, how do you even do that? This is lower than the original as well. Oh, is it? Oh, God. <laughs> There's no graceful way, there is only a fast way. Okay. The technique is as follows. Yeah. Place left leg as far in as you can possibly get it. Yep, so then, left leg in. Then fall down. And then fall down, then fall down and hope for the best. Observe. Observe. Left leg all the way in. Yep. Ah, very good. Ta-da. Ta-da, I'm in the car, right. Get out. It's worse. <laughs> so if you can hold my camera and video can. this. Yeah, because there's no way I'm going to be able to do that. So left leg in. Yeah, all the way, all the way, then fall down. Ugh. Oh, bloody there you go. Oh. Oh. oh, sick. I'm in. It's <laughs> on. The worst That's, bit. I'm not dreading of getting out. Yeah. <laughs> How am I going to get out? It's like being birthed. <laughs> Right leg out, and then basically brace yourself against the seat and the wheel, and just squeeze yourself out like some ketchup at the end of the bottle. Um, <laughs> no grab handles in it. Oh. 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 So go. gracious right now. Like a natural. <laughs> like a natural. Really like a natural. How do you do that? <laughs> I'd be like, oh god, Tesco petrol station, I can't get out of it. <laughs> I let you into a little secret, right? Yeah. The roof. Yeah. You can unclip it from the inside. Oh, I was gonna so say just as well. <laughs> occasionally, if no one's looking, I'll roll the roof. Just back, roll it back. Stand up, step out, <laughs> and go. Oh, look at me! I've just got out of my Lotus. That's great. That's considerably harder than I thought it was gonna be. Yeah. Got to do the same this side now. So, <laughs> hey, wait. Looks worse this side. So, getting in a Lotus Elise. 
Oh, we are actually touching. So exciting. Very intimate. It's really nice in here though. Like, it's so track focused. We're track moments right now. I love that like my knee is like here. Yep. <laughs> like so close. And it's like, oh, it's so small, but like quite it's nice snug. in a way. Like I quite like it. Definition of B road bashing, then that was, wasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> that, that was all right. Oh, you did well there, mate. You did well. This car does bloody well, I tell you. I love it. It's so great. it's so light, and you know, you know these roads, so it's like easy for you to really get what you want out of this car, which is the maddest thing. To be honest, the main reason you can go quick along these roads in this car is that I'm not taking up more than my half of the road. Yeah, because the car's so small, you can actually. Yeah. Get past I've things driven, if they come the other way. So I've like, driven an R8 along here. It's terrifying. Bloody hell. You're yeah. over the white it's line. Wide, yeah. yeah. That's a scary thought yeah. right there. <laughs> so, quick pit stop as the heavens are sort of starting to open. This is how easy it is to put a Lotus roof on a Lotus. <laughs> Literally two bars and then a bit of cloth, basically. <laughs> if it was in the boot. Works out pretty well. It means you don't get wet. Ooh, a Mustang. Yeah. Awesome, just like that. What's that, 20 seconds to put it on? Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> At least that. Right, we get some exhaust shots. Try and get a flyby as well. Now I've got to get back in the car with the roof on. Oh, oh God. <laughs> I'm stuck. Oh, oh the, hat, the hat came off. Oh, yeah. Ugh. Sick. It's considerably harder with the roof on. 